Hey guys, how are you doing? So, when I put my deck system in, I'll show you in a second. I think I had done a video putting it in the deck system. I lost the ability to use the tie downs that are on the floor or lower in the uh, bed of the truck. So I just ordered some tie downs. And I didn't even notice my truck had these little tie down things around and I'll show you where they're at in here. But let's see here. So the deck system here, your deck system when it's hooked on, hopefully you can see this, you use these tie downs down here to hold the deck system in place on both sides. And then up in the front also, you use those to tie this deck system down. Um, I do have these tie downs right here on both sides, but I didn't notice that I have nine other ones. There's a total of nine all the way around the inside bed of the truck. So I bought this. You can see these, this is from Bull Rings. Let's see if I can get that on here, Bull Ring. Uh, they, get, they don't give you any instructions in here, but if you go onto that video right there, that little website, it'll show you how to put them in. It was very simple when I looked at it. You just basically popping out the covers that are right there. You can see that cover. I'll get down in there and show you. But you pop out that cover and then you put this in there. Right here, this guy. And this one will go in this way. So it's facing this way, so it's gravity fed when you're not using it. It'll go back down when you want to use it. You can pull this up, it will snap into place. All right, so we're going to go into the bed of the truck and we're going to put this baby in there. All right, all right, guys. So here's the bed of the truck. Sorry, there's still a little bit of blood in here. Never washed it out from when I shot my deer. All right, so I'll lay this Osmo action down here. All right, guys, here we go. All right, so I'll show you this thing up close again. So this is the cap that I need to remove right here. And then this is the one that we're going to be putting in its place. It's gravity fed. We're going to put it in that way. When it's not in use, it'll stay down like that. When you pull it up, it will snap into place. So let's see how easy this is to put in. All right, so we're going to just pop this cap off. That was pretty easy. You can see that caps out, the holes there. And then we're going to take this and put it in to the hole. Should just pop in. All right. Nice and snug in the hole. And then all you're supposed to be able to do is turn the Phillip head bit. They say hand tighten. Do not use a power drill. So we are hand tightening it. And there we go. All right. Hopefully you can see that. So now we have a tie down and you pull it. Now it's locked in place in the open position. You can see that open position now. And then all I have to do is push it and now it's retract and it's out of the way. That is pretty slick. And that took nothing and they're supposed to have, I think it's a 2000 pound pull rate. Pull it, now I have tie down, push it in, gravity fed, it puts it down. And what'd that take? Less than a minute? All right, I've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven more to go, so 10 minutes, I'll be done. All right. So that was really easy. My granddaughter just went up to the park with my wife. She gets back in time, maybe I'll have her install one for you. Okay guys, so my granddaughter got back. What's your name? Luli. Luli, and she is going to show you how easy it is to install this silly thing. I did these in no time at all, but we're gonna put her in. So she's sticking it in the hole here. 
Yeah, no, just give it a nice little. Wrong way, I think. Nope, that was the right way. Yep, just like that. Yep, I'm just gonna get it to go in there flush. There you go. Hold it with your one hand, like we said. Okay, and then put the screwdriver underneath there. Turn it righty tighty, just like you're going. There you go. Keep going. Keep going. Keep going. Now push hard towards the. I'll pull pull that out of the way. Get your bit back on there. There you go. Now push hard towards the screw and keep turning towards you. Yep. There you go. That's it. Done. All right. There we go. Like that. You pull it. Pull it all the way out and then snap it in place. Pull that all the way out with your finger and pull hard. It'll snap in place. Come on. There it is. Now it's in done. Push it in done. How easy was that? Even a kid could do it. Right? All right. Say goodbye to everybody. Bye-bye. All right, guys. See you later. Just a little quick thing for my Sierra 2018-1500. Now I have tie-downs because the deck system used up my tie-downs. And I know you can get a rail for the deck system, but the month after I bought this, they came out with their new deck system. Um, and I think their rail thing sticks up. So I didn't want, I wanted to have a flat surface back here. All right, guys, I will see you later. Have a great day. Watch for some more videos coming out. Bye-bye.